This instructional video is designed to demonstrate how to create a buffer solution with the proper uh, desired pH. <sighs> this instructional video <laughs> This instructional video is designed to show you how to calculate the proper ratio of undissociated acid with its conjugate ion in order to make a buffer solution with the desired pH. In order to do this, we'll need the identity of the undissociated acid, in this case, acetic acid, the source of the conjugate, sodium acetate, the desired pH, 4.55, and the Ka for the acid itself. With all of this information, we can write out the Henderson-Hasselbalch equation, where pH equals the pKa plus the log of the ratio of these two components. In this case, we're going to have the acetate ion from the sodium acetate. I'll just sort that with a C and the undissociated acetic acid. Once we have this, we can substitute in the values we have here and here. We have a pH of 4.55 as the target. pKa requires the negative log of the Ka. So I'll write in minus log of 1.8 times 10 to the minus 5 plus the log of our ratio of acetate ion to acetic acid. We can take the negative log here and we get a value of 4.74. So the only thing remaining now is to simplify this, so that we have the log on one side and our numbers on the other side. This comes out to negative 0 0.19 equals the logarithm of the ratio. And if we raise, if we take 10 to the minus 0.19 and 10 to the log of the ratio, will have just the ratio itself. So this leaves us with 10 to the minus 0.19 equals the ratio of acetate ion to undissociated acetic acid. Once we have this, we simply have to evaluate this expression. And what we find is 0.646 is the ratio of acetate ion to the acetic acid. Now, because this is the proper ratio, let's suppose we have the acetic acid concentration of one molar. Then we can determine how much uh, concentration of sodium acetate we need. And the sodium acetate should then be 0.646 molar. Uh, sodium acetate. So if we were to create a solution with this ratio, by proper application of the Henderson Hasselbalch equation, we should be able to maintain a pH buffer, uh, a buffer pH of 4.55.